Well, I went to get some footage of the LR small block and my GoPro battery is fucking dead. It's completely puffed up and it doesn't even fit in the camera anymore. You can see the LiPos are all gassed up. So I ordered a new one online. This uh, makes sense because it's been underperforming and dying like every 30 minutes. Now it won't even turn on. So the GoPro is useless right now. And uh, we gotta wait till we get a new battery or else we can't get any more footage. All right, we're gonna go on our second ride. We did ride the bike yesterday and it performed pretty well. I still think I'm running a false positive because this Kelly controller and this motor is very loud when they're paired together. But the bike is actually faster, which makes sense because sometimes when you're running false positives, uh, it makes the windings or something with the timing make it, it increases the speed of the motor. But now the top speed of the bike is 47 instead of 42. And uh, we're going to go for a little ride with the Talaria. The Talaria is only at about probably 50 or 60%. Her battery is full. Well, the LR small block is doing good with the Kelly controller, even though I think we got a false positive and it's very loud, it runs. But yeah, my, my brake is yeah, my brake, uh, my brake welding job didn't really work too well. The stopping power bent the bracket, so I only welded it right at the face here. And the bracket runs all the way over there and it bent. So I had to loosen her brakes up because they were kind of rubbing and dragging. And now I got it so loose that it barely does anything when you pull it all the way in just so she can ride around without it dragging. Yeah, the water is like super low right now. Yeah, you can literally walk across the water right now. Wow. It's been raining a lot too. I'm just... I remember seeing someone like surf down there. Remember that one time? Yeah. It's probably going to be really muddy over there. Geez, we were going to ride down the trail, but it's so washed out, you can't even get through the swamp. There's usually a giant, it's like a puddle of like water just always down there. It's starting to rain out pretty hard. I know, I'm like, we can't even make it past this. <laughs> and we're like <laughs> 10 miles from the house. My battery, I didn't charge it like an idiot. I plugged it in for like an hour. So I'm at 40, actually. I'm at 776. 49%. And she's at 77.5 volts out of 82. So you're, going you're at like 70% probably. <laughs> All right, well, we're gonna get caught in the rain. It's coming down. We might have to find some place to hide for a little while. So far so good. Other than the rear brake breaking, everything else is going good. Yeah, seriously. The rear brake is not breaking because it broke. Get it? That's, um, that's funny. That's, you're supposed to laugh. Oh, you can put like a picture of me laughing. <laughs> All right, my bike is about to die. It's at 21%.
We just got caught in the rain. 71.4, 21%. I got 233 miles now. I can't believe there's so many freaking cars out here. We're like on a, we're on like a back road in the middle of nowhere. And there's cars everywhere today. So my battery is just blinking. I'm at 21%, but I'm in eco mode so I can make it home. We're not too far from the house. We're probably only like four miles. Maybe five. Yeah, I don't think it's that far, but it's a lot of driving. And it's just starting to rain now. We got these clouds. 11%, 239 miles.